welcome um <laughs> this is the full moon reading for the air sign people i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um um please remember um to if you're not a member use the link here and use the link here to notification notification is here subscribe here all right um air sign people let's see what is coming up this reading is for the um the aquarian gemini's and libra okay first we're looking at the sun sign people and then we look at the moon sign people and then we look at all the six houses okay all right so first the sun sign people and sometimes sun moon and rising sign can have the same energies so, so be aware of that all right so i want to say thank you so much for being here go check out the 444 video and uh, um please be safe um please leave the worries behind please find out who you are and it is going to be okay so let's see what is coming in um for you guys all right so we see judgment corporation institution all right i put my glasses on corporation institution some of you are dealing with then we see that some of you are going to be turning your back to a corporation institution for whatever reason it is then i see the knight of pentacles whoever this person is this is a taurus Virgo, or capricorn in a corporation institution and i see you're standing your ground and protecting yourself then we see no worries um it is as if uh, you're not worried about this person whatever they have done is coming out uh, and uh, you need to protect yourself okay you're standing your ground you need to protect yourself more and another times nine so you have two nines so a cycle is definitely going to be over for you guys okay so I see you have to make a decision, whatever is transpiring, you have to make a decision. All right, so what we're seeing here, ladies and gentlemen, is that, I'm trying to look in the camera also, is that some of you are dealing with a corporation institution and there is a, a hurt sign person that you're having issues with. You have no regrets, you're standing ground um, to this person. I see you, you want a new start, you wanna move away from the situation and you are standing your ground and this is good and i see that at the end of the day you need to make some decision okay some of you are too open some issue situation is going to be over that is something that you guys should know some issue or situation is going to be over in your life because the energy of the nine uh number nine is here and when the energy of number nine is here there is an end that is coming to an issue and a situation. So what we're seeing here is that some of you could be living a corporation institution or whether this is transpiring. I see some of you are protecting yourself from a corporation institution. I see some of you are trying to find the truth within a situation with um, a young earth sign person. And I see some of you have some regrets, but you're going to be making a decision in order to protect yourself and to leave a situation behind. What I'm seeing is that some of you are just too open and you have to be aware of this. So sun sign um, here, people be aware. So with the corporation institution, I see a company. I see huge corporation institution. A lot of you, if you work, you could be having a lot of meetings. People are trying to um, plan for the future. A lot of meetings is going to be going on however this is coming up and transpiring i see a whole lot of meeting is going on uh, when it comes to people in corporation institution a whole lot of meetings so be aware of that then with this knight of pentacles i see this working woman so you could be having um there was an affair of the work floor now you're at home you can't talk to this person this person is pushing to talk to you and you are trying to protect yourself from this person so whoever this working person is is a working lady and it has to do with a corporation institution lies and deceptiveness um with this person i see um military military is police 
and that sort of a thing is coming up so be aware of it so some of you will have some situation to deal with military and you need to protect yourself whatever is going on especially at the moment some of you need to protect yourself I see some of you are like um, you could be um, someone who's a police military or, or you are a reserve army person maybe you're called to go back to duties okay so this is coming up I see a situation with a friend I see you're too open to a friend whoever this friend is I see you're going to make a decision to either end the relationship I see that this friend is um, wants all of your attention and it's as if you are the one who needs to call them all the time and I see you're going to make a decision so it says I got my life I gotta live my life I have no time whenever I have free time I have to spend it either to heal myself or find rest in myself but I see this friendship is a bit um, too much um, let's say that and I see that you are going to be making a decision um, you know whether or not you're going to be um, letting this person take all your time and energy because I see that this person is just for um, themselves it's always uh, you know for themselves okay you have to make a living so it could be someone who is a uh, um, work um, in contract and this person is basically you know taking up your time and you are going to decide yeah I need to have my time whenever it's my time is for my myself and my family okay however that is played so I see um, some of you I see meetings could be call corporation institution we're going to be looking at that so I see meetings could be called some of you could be after the meeting deciding to end um, whatever is going on okay so we're going to be looking I see some of you are receiving an offer from a corporation institution but you're not taking the offer it could be a payout but it's more of you're receiving an offer maybe um, to do more work or so but it's as if uh, no um, I see you um, decide not to take this offer for whatever the reason is so however this is transpiring it's going to be affecting um, the Aquarians so a sun sign Aquarians I see you're going to be rejecting an offer the rest of you might take the offer okay but I see the Aquarians are really standing up and rejecting the offer so however that is coming up it's as if there's a meeting there's conversation there's uh, you know you could be asking they want to pay you out or uh, that sort of a thing but I see the Aquarians are standing against this so I see truths are coming out about a young um, lady it's a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn Shoots is coming out about this person um, and I see that you're not regretting it because you think um, you know whatever is transpiring definitely truths are coming out about a young working Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person the truths are coming out people are seeing the truths with a connection with a Leo and what this young lady has done she's in the reverse position so obviously um, some of you is a young lady some of you is a young man but whatever is transpiring they saw the truth as to what she has done and I see um, some of you um, this is affecting you via work and I see that some of you are turning your backs on this person because you saw what this person has done so I see some investigation and I see that some of you are going to be winning this investigation however this is transpiring we're seeing the energy of you Aquarians really standing up um, and feeling the energy in uh, this full moon so Aquarians go and uh, you know if you're not yet a member of the channel you can just choose for the 499 it's there you can pick it up in that okay um, and I see um, people are standing up and really standing up whatever the issue and the situation is some of you are dealing with a cancer and you are standing up I see an investigation is going on and you're standing up to whatever I see an offer is going to be coming in because they have realized what has happened and what has transpired truth has been told and the truth is coming out to whatever the issue and the situation is and whatever is transpiring so there is a lot of conflicts and I see that um, some of you are going to be called back in reserve I see justice come down on a friend whoever this person is I see um, 
it's as if this person has done some injustice against some of you and i see that they have been now caught um they people find out the truth of who this person is and what they have done it could be you ladies 50 years and older i see you um come down on a friend um you see the truth about a friend that a friend only wants to keep you um on a string for when they need time and when they want to be with you and you saw where this is going and i see that you're ending of this situation you're making a decision about this friend okay um uh and definitely the truth is coming out about this friend so um ladies 50 years and older i see you really are um are going to be protecting yourself from a friend whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring i see this friend has been using you to accommodate for themselves um gains okay so however this is transpiring i see that people are going to be understanding certain situations a lot of you are turning your backs on friendship because of some form of a friend is using you to acquire uh, financial success and that sort of a thing and i see definitely you're deciding hell no um you know you're using my information my time in order um for you to be successful and i see you're saying no um the outcomes is that i see some of you are walking away from a situation and saying no to a situation and i see you are moving forward in creating your own financial stability and this is good because what is happening and transpiring is as if um it could be in uh, at work that they're offering you less pay or that sort of a thing and you're saying no some of you are walking away some of you are taking it but with friendship i see some of you are going to be choosing um, to create your own financial stability um, over the end and, and for your family so that your family can have a good financial stability and end in friendships and end in jobs and walking away because you are choosing to create your own financial stability. So there is a lot that is going on because I see that you guys are going to be making decision that is going to be helping you and your family and creating financial abundance. I see an offer is going to be coming in um whatever that was transpiring um a new offer is going to be coming in so i see a lot of conversation is happening over a young working lady um this lady um could be a lawyer or could be a, um but she is definitely a tor a hurt sign person so um so um, whoever this person is I see they're having conversation this person um, could be a friend of yours uh, that sell you out or has done some deceptiveness I see you're going to make a decision about this person because you know who this person is and what they have done you're definitely going to be making a decision about this person so I see um, some of you have been offered something from a corporation institution and it is as if no um i can do better for myself and i see that you're going to be choosing to do better for yourself especially you ladies 50 years and older or ladies on the own is going to be thinking no i'm not taking the offer i am going to start for myself because i can do better for myself i see information is coming some of you are going to be speaking up about this young person whoever this person is this is a young person this is a taurus virgo or a capricorn i see you're going to speaking up speaking up against them and what they have done i see truths are coming out and i see an offer is going to be coming in for some of you however this is happening and transpiring definitely an offer because people are going to be seeing exactly what is transpiring um between you and another person whether at work whether in your private life and an offer is going to be coming in so again we have a corporation institution and i see some of you could be looking for a new job or want to move forward leaving this corporation institution behind for whatever reason i see some of you are standing protecting yourself from a hurt sign person this person is between the ages of 18 and 45 so be aware of that i saw some of you are not regretting anything but you need to protect yourself more you're too melancholy you need to protect yourself more okay and i see the nine of wands that is coming up and some of you need to make some decision and 
um the worries is going to be over but now you need to protect yourself more so this is good Alrighty, that was for the sun sign people let's see what's coming out for the moon sign here people so let's see what's coming out for the moon sign air people um and remember that these readings are timeless so whenever you pick up this reading whenever you listen to this reading it is the time that you're supposed to have this message so moon sign fire sign i see you standing up i see you standing up i see you using your power but in the wrong way be careful and this is um um young people i see you're trying to use the power over a taurus Virgo, or a capricorn in the wrong way so it could be a mother whoever this person is okay i see it has to do with some money however this is transpiring i see you young people um and it has to do with family money however this is transpiring so what we're seeing here for you moon sign people is that some of you are there is some uh, information that is going to be coming out it could be your mom your mom that is a taurus virgo um this person is coming up as a virgo this person could be a family member and i see whatever is transpiring um, that is coming up. I see some of you want to just turn your back and leave the situation behind it. It has to do with a lot of money. The money is in reverse and it's kind of, it's like family money. Okay. The corporation is coming back up also for you guys. So I see some of you are definitely looking for a new corporation. Is it a financial institution or is it work or is it something that has to do with work? I hear again, Someone is standing their grounds, protecting themselves as they move forward, leaving some situation that has to do with family money. And uh, this person is also coming up uh, in the reverse. So uh, a lot of you are protecting yourself from a young person because uh, this is a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person. And you're protecting yourself from this person because you're seeing the truth about this person. I see an Elin is going to be coming in. However, it is coming up and Elin is going to be coming in. So I see information is coming in. It could be from a mother or it could be from a supervisor, your boss, an aunt, but it's a family member. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I see some situation with some money. Um, I see that some of you are definitely having issues with family and money. However, that is transpiring. I see the six of swords. However, this is transpiring. Um, some of you are want to move forward from a corporation institution. You are just not liking these um, people and situation. The seven of ones is here where some of you are protecting yourself from a young Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person, whoever this person is. It's as if this person is between the ages of 18 and 45. This person is not vibing on the right vibe, okay? So it's as if you are standing your ground. So whatever is transpiring information is going to be coming out of, um, about um, and uh, a lady 50 years and older. It's a hurt sign lady. Whoever this person is, I see information is going to be coming out about this person. Very surprising um, information or this person could be giving you some surprising information. OK, so it could be um, someone who is going to be helping you out unexpected this this lady is really going to be helping you out and want to connect with you then i see the ten of cups and the ten of pentacles and i see some of you are desperate some of you are desperate with a family situation some of you are desperate with financial um situation some of you are desperate because you need financial stone for your family however this desperation is coming up we're going to be looking at that because i see some of you could be just desperate because you're in um the area of your family now a corporation institution i see some of you there is could be some jail time some of you um is leaving a corporation institute you could be getting out of jail but this is an imprisonment card so you could be self imprisonment depression and that sort of a thing but this is a corporation so it's jail that some of you could be getting out of jail okay some of you really really could be getting out of jail however that is transpiring so whether it's mentally or physically some of you are getting out of jail now i see a whole lot of sadness that is going to be coming up um for some of you if your child is a taurus virgo or a capricorn i see a lot of sadness is coming up 
whatever the issue and the situation is this person could have been on drugs or in some serious situation this person could be coming out of jail and you don't want to take them in the house and that sort of a thing um, but ladies and gentlemen we have to think that this is family whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring definitely I said someone could be coming out of jail for some of you or could be coming out of the hospital or com could be coming out of a mental institution or could be coming out of a, a drugs rehabilitation however this person is coming up and where they're coming from I see some of you do not really want to um, connect with them so I see some unexpected surprise um, whoever the story is Virgo or Capricorn woman is she's 50 years and older and she's going to be helping you guys out in um, various ways so whoever this lady is and whatever is transpiring I see this lady is going to be helping you guys out um, some on uh, um, some um, information is going to be coming out so with the energy of the lovers I see some of you if this person some of you are going to be realizing that this um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person you're connected with them and some of you are going to be realizing that is your twin flame or a soulmate you could be married to this person or you could have known this person then you're going to be realizing oh my god um, that is really my twin flame or soulmate unexpected surprises but it's good because this person is going to be letting you on some in on some secrets secrets is going to be coming out she's going to be letting you on some secrets about your partner or about your husband or wife however this is transpiring it could be a mother that is going to be unexpectedly leaving you everything um, maybe she's not dead but she's going to be making sure that you receive uh, everything okay I see desperation about some money and I see news is going to be coming in um, that you need to pay a whole lot of money or something like that but you're desperate however this is coming in it could be it because it is in the reverse so maybe you have to pay out but it has something to do with the family okay so um, however that is transpiring I see heartbreaks with a family whatever is happening whatever is transpiring heartbreaks between you and your family some desperate situations maybe um, someone is sick you have to pay out a lot of money but I see secrets and heartbreaks come out about the family it could be heartbreaks about a Pisces person whoever this person is it could be a mother however this is affecting you but I see desperation about a whole lot of money and um, I see Elin is going to be coming up and this Elin is going to be coming in because I see that some of you decide that a corporation institution is not right thing for you and you're going to be turning your back on this corporation institution um, some of you could be um, that finally some information came um, out that help you to get out uh, of some corporation I see um, a corporation helping you um, a corporation is going to be apologizing to some of you um, whatever is transpired I see a huge corporation is going to be apologizing to some of you for some deceptive situation that has transpired in your world okay then I see the energy of your material wealth I see some of you are going to be protecting your material wealth however this is transpiring I see some sadness sadness um, that is affecting you or your child your child is a earth sign I see some sadness that is um, affecting you and your child but I see you're protecting your financial stability some of you could have been in a relationship with a young um, hurt sign person I see this is coming up whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring this person I see a lot of conflicts a lot of conflicts with this person you guys have number 77 77 it is um, you're on the right part however this is happening and transpiring 77 is that you are on the right part you are on the right part you know the truth about a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person you know exactly what they have done okay whoever this person is this person is um, from abroad okay so this this whoever this person is is really from abroad because what we see here is the traveler the traveler is someone who is coming in from a different uh, um, from overseas whoever this person is and whatever but it's not happening for them because it's as if it's as if they are being blocked 
they are being blocked because of some information that came out people found out what they have done so some of you are dealing with some foreign or someone who were born in another place and whatever is transpired is a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person and whatever has transpired I see that truths is going to be coming out about this person whoever this person is whatever is transpired I see truths is coming out about this person so whoever this person is you need to stand your ground with this person and you need to um this person is actually your enemy um it is a friend enemy so be aware of this this person is a friend enemy whoever this person is is very deceptive and it's a friend enemy i would say just block the person instead of having anything to say to this person just block the person so with relationship what i'm seeing especially um, some of you are going to be finding out some information about your partner, your wife, someone you're in a relationship with, and there you're going to be finding out something about this person. And it has to do that this person only became in a relationship because of financial money, because unexpected surprising news is going to be coming in and you're going to be finding out who this person is. There is some issues that is going to be coming up in the family. So when we're looking at uh, um, the houses, we're going to be seeing what is that issue. But I see sadness and depression. So a Taurus, Virgo or a Capricorn woman is going to be um, surprisingly giving you some information and letting you on some secret about uh, um, something. Desperation is here and it has to do with the family and a whole lot of money that could have been lost or stolen from you guys. Okay. It has to do with money and family, with the desperation. Now, someone could be getting out of, uh, um, and, and it's coming up as um, drug rehabilitation. So, uh, and you're wondering, yeah, some of you are like, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so this person is coming out of rehab. However, this is transpiring. You need to find balance to deal with this person. Okay, so... You can't just leave them on the street. You need you need to find balance to deal with this person. So however this is transpiring, I see someone is coming in or you could be leaving rehab or someone is leaving. But I see family has to work together in order to facilitate this. So, um, whatever is transpiring, I see um, an uh, oak on corporation institution is going to be offering an apology an apology to something that has deceptively happened to you and i see that they're going to be offering the apology because it's at first the corporation institution and then the apology is going to be offered to you and excuses they're going to be offering excuses to you as to what has transpired now there is a lot of sadness i'm not seeing debt i'm just seeing sadness sadness because some of you found out something about your materialistic wealth we're going to be looking at this the houses to see how it is affecting each and every one of you remember that this is just a general reading okay in order to get a personalized reading you need to order um an astro clock on my website so some sadness sadness has to do with your materialistic wealth um your money um your financial stability there has the sadness because you're trying to protect it with all costs okay you're protecting that with all costs so however it is transpiring you're really protecting it with by all costs and I see a conflict is coming up with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person whoever this person is there's a lot of conflicts this person has created a lot of conflicts a very deceptive person but the person is a little bit off it is a friend enemy so be aware of this okay a lot is coming up ladies and gentlemen a lot is coming up a lot I have to say this a lot is coming up so be aware of what is transpiring um, whoever that young Taurus and is a young person, they're very deceptive. I see some heartbreaks coming up in the family. Um, it has to do with money. Um, but whoever this young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is, is very, very deceptive. Okay. So this person could be reaching out to you guys. Very deceptive. All right. So we are looking at the first house. Okay. 
The second house, the first house is yourself. The second house is money. The third house is where you live, your environment, where you live. It's about um, also sibling. Fourth house is a family. Sixth house is your everyday activity. Seventh house is your uh, marriage relationship. Eighth house is contracts, um, inheritance, and the Kundalini energy. Tenth house, reputation. Eleventh house, house of the Aquarians. So be aware of what fall in that house. Alrighty. So um, let's go take a look and see. And I think that what I'm going to be doing is basically just give the information per house and then you can um, uh, retain it and you can go back and check the videos okay because I always give and then I'm going to let you know um, what is the good house um, where is the luck is going to be coming in um, what is the bad house after that okay let me know how you find this reading um, so be aware of that let me know how you find this reading okay so let's see oh i should have uh, okay so all right that's okay so let's um see what is happening and transpiring all righty It's coming up for the hair sign people oh you have a lot of problems with the Aries oh my god you fall in the house of the Aries Virgos are going to be helping you to have money oh well, I see some of you are ripping a, a Aries out of your life for good and that is good mm. okay um luck but this Leo Yeah, I was just looking at something. Ooh. Ooh, la, la. Oh, yeah. Well, it's a Pisces. Uh, whoever is in a relationship with a Pisces. All right, let's see you, Leo. Oh, yeah. They're investigating the Leo and the travel, some travel documents. Gemini, I see you're clearing up. So, this looks good. All right. House by house, I'm going to be doing you guys. So, in the first house, I see you are having some challenge with yourself in the first house. The first house is self and you have the square conflict. So a lot of inner conflicts that is going on. But why is because of this um, Aries. Whoever this Aries is, is creating a lot of inner conflicts. This Aries is on the investigation, okay? And they are creating inner conflicts for you guys. So be aware of this. And um, whoever this Aries is... Uh, they could be using negative forces to connect with you. So be aware of this because whoever this Aries is, is very deceptive and is trying to use manipulating energies in order to connect you and create um, inner conflicts with, within yourself because this is a negative energy of this Aries. Now you fall in the house of the Aries and whatever is transpiring, some of you could be having issues with Aries and you fall in the house of the Aries. This is not good, especially with um the square challenges all right so be aware of the aries um whoever is uh, working together with aries they could be creating some issues in your world in the second house of financial stability i see luck is coming up and a virgo is going to be helping you um a virgo man is going to be helping some of you in order to create financial stability um in your world whoever this person is uh, um, definitely a Virgo and they're going to be bringing in luck um, to help you with your business and your financial stability so this is a wonderful wonderful positive energy that is going on especially for your financial world and your business and money okay so luck is in the house a Virgo is going to be helping you 
then I see the third house the third house is uh, um, for you Gemini's and what is in your third house is the unexpected information so that is where um, uh, Capricorn could be helping you out this is your house um, Gemini's so Gemini's I see you men are going to be um, unexpected news could be coming in from overseas because this is the energy of the Sagittarius the Voyager so someone abroad could be helping you out however this is transpiring I see help is coming in from abroad or someone who is um, from another country or was born in another country but you are going to be help unexpected help is going to be coming in in order to help you out of certain issues and situations so this is very positive because it's very true so it could be the Capricorn that is going to be bringing the surprise and it's for you Gemini's okay as we look at the house the fourth house of family I see some healing is coming up with the family I see some of you were dealing with a young Pisces person um, this person is between the ages of uh, 18 and 45 and I see healing between you and this family member whoever this family member is it can be also a cancer but whoever this person is whether cancer or scorpion uh, or Pisces I see an healing between you and this person because an healing is in the house of the fourth house and this is the house of family as we go to the house of the Leos whatever is happening and transpiring what we're seeing is that with the house of fashion friendship entertainment if there is not much going on because of this sh shutdown and however this is transpiring and happening I see um, some of you could be ending a relationship uh, um, with a Capricorn this person could have been a very good friend however this is transpiring I see illusion so I see that a Leo could be creating illusion so that you end a relationship with a Capricorn so be careful of what is happening and transpiring because whoever this Leo is is that this Leo is creating some deceptiveness and it says if no matter what this Leo does this Capricorn person is going to be helping you guys so they're creating this Leo because it's the house of the Leo and this is Neptune so this is about people using black um, black magic witchcraft in order to block you and a Capricorn from a relationship or a communication but I see that this is uh, going to be ending people do not understand what is transpiring because uh, not everyone um, negative forces and negative energies can and I see that there some of you are having some issues with a Capricorn and some of you wants to get out and is trying to use witchcraft and black magic last person don't hurt our earth sign people conflicts and queen cost in your everyday so work is going to be changing your everyday duties there's some come um, there is really some um, complexity um, within your everyday duties and that is in the house of the Virgos but the Virgos are going to be helping you out now I see some of you are dealing with an Aquarian and um, you Aquarian you're having some conflicting things with your um, financial stability but the Virgos is, is there is a coupling with you Aquarians um, and the Virgos because uh, um, the rest of the uh, the rest of you guys are good but the Aquarians there is some conflicting things uh, with your everyday life so Aquarians be aware of this um, with your fortune um, be aware because you're in the house of the Virgos they're not helping you but the liberals they're helping the liberals and the Gemini so be aware of that and it has to do with your fortune then we look at the house of marriage and I see that uh, um, relationships is going to be ending Saturn comes in um, to bring back discipline in relationship marriages and I see that some of you are going to be choosing um, to go with a Taurus um, I see some divorces if you're divorcing a Taurus um, I see that you could be um, receive papers from a Taurus or a Taurus is going to be offering you and asking you for a divorce so I see um, some of you um, that healing is coming up in relationship because of Saturn but when Saturn comes in relationship um, it can be very horrible I see a situation that some of you are dealing with a Taurus who is a lawyer or some issue it could be divorce that is transpiring in the house of relationship remember these are general readings so I can't go specific um, but it's happening with a Taurus lawyer I see a, a whole lot of changes then I see um, 
conjunction empowerment conjunction and this is in the house of the eight house the eight house is the house of the scorpion so i see some of you are standing your grounds a scorpion and a cancer is creating conflicts whether with your inheritance whether with your um, a business whether with a business agreement however this person is a, a very obsessive and is trying to um, create conflicts in your world so be aware of the scorpion um, because it is in the uh, eight house of the house of the scorpion be aware because it can affect you guys okay so you are dealing with a scorpion and a cancer but i i, I see either a scorpion for some of you and a cancer for some of you is trying to uh, move yeah create uh, and i see you're going to be letting go of this person or the situation and take back your empowerment so i see you're releasing a cancer and a scorpion out of your life and that is good as we see the ninth house the ninth house has to do with foreign um travels um adventures and that sort of a thing and i see you have some luck whatever is transpiring you are lucky over a leo because they're going to be finding out a leo um has been very deceptive so whoever is having some issues with a leo who is uh, it has to do with passport travel documents information and that sort of a thing i see you're going to be lucky over a leo because uh, um a leo has done some uh as either stolen pass um information and i see luck is on your side because they're going to be finding out that this leo has been very deceptive okay it could be you guys and it could be um you're going to be telling people that this leo is deceptive in the house of reputation i see a tower moment is coming down because uh, um this scorpion tried to ruin your reputation um whether it's a scorpion woman an old scorpion woman tried to ruin your reputation and i see a tall moment is coming down for this lady now it could be a supervisor whoever the scorpion person is it could be a supervisor whether man or woman they try to ruin your reputation and i see a capricorn is going to be helping you out because the the tent house is the house of the capricorn is going to be helping you out in order to re um reinstate your reputation okay there is really some really deceptive people around so be aware but i see a capricorn is going to be coming back to re to help you um because a capricorn know the truth um about what is going on and they are going to be helping you now the 11th house 11th house i see you have opposition of balance now when opposition of balance come in is that um discipline but manifesting conflicts between you and others and testing so there could be legal issues or there could be a um, opposition from opposition of interest from groups of people especially at your work because this person is a working person and I see that this person could be a Libran whoever this person is it is a Libran whatever is transpiring I see this is a Libran person that you're having some opposition so Librans be aware of this and we're going to be going back and looking at the house for the Librans so this is the house of the Aquarians and what is transpiring in the house of the Aquarians is that you are having some opposition um, uh, issues with a Libran okay and this is a Libran on the work floor so Aquarians this is going to be affecting you deeply especially you work in ladies because um, there could be time for a new contract and um, whatever is transparent some of you are going to be having issues with um, personnel um, personnel department and uh, uh, um, yeah that sort of illegalities for you working ladies so be aware of that you um aquarian ladies or gentlemen now liberals um before i yeah let's end this 12 hours the 12 hours is where um elin is going to be coming in you guys are going back to the akashic records a whole lot of elin is going to be coming in people are going to be seeing the truth and situation that is transpiring I see you Gemini's fall in the house of Elin. So I see you Gemini's Elin a lot of situation. 
and I see you Gemini's are going to be receiving a new contract so whatever is transpiring Gemini's you fall in the house of the 11th house this is good because I see your healing past life issues and I see you're going to be rewarded a new contract if you're looking for a new contract so it's all about healing for the rest of you you're going to be finding the ascendance uh, um um, opposition where you're healing yourself and healing things around you and this is very good positive energies is coming up because you guys are finding who out you, who you are investigating and trying to figure out who you are Gemini's a new contract is going to be coming up for you and I see some happiness that is going to be coming in so Gemini's whatever is transpiring it looks good for you guys now um we're going back by the liberance because I could sh I should have said this to the liberance now liberance I see you're dealing with um um a Taurus person and this is a lawyer so it could be a divorce that is affecting you guys so this is the house of relationships so you liberance you're dealing with a Taurus and it could be a lawyer whoever this person is okay um all right so the best house is travel foreign foreign affair and situation um money looks good money is good and virgo is going to be helping out some of you to make a lot of money people in your environment especially young people i see people are going to be loving you some of you are going to be connecting um with foreigners people from foreign cultures different foreign cultures and i see that some of you are going to be healing a problem and relationship in the family with a pisces or a water sign person which could be a pisces or a cancer all right so aquarian um you are going to be having some um um conflicts with your financial stability with a virgo you fall in the house of the virgo uh so um that's where you're going to be having some issue liberance you fall in the house of of the Aquarians where you are going to be having opposition um, opposition from um, conflict opposition conflicts with an Aquarian okay so be aware but Gemini it is a good term you um, realize who you are where you want to be I see Gemini's you're going to be receiving a new contract happiness and joy all right namaste